Everything is difficult Help me help you Girl, what you trying to do? Cause I don't got a clue no. Hello there folks, Jason, JCTV here With a... Uh, not exactly a mystery unboxing Cause I do know what they are, I've already opened them, I couldn't wait uh, But I've basically got a bunch of minifigures Now, uh, the first two I got from uh, Toys R Us but then I know, so you know, unfortunately they are closing down, uh, which is a shame because I used to get some good stuff in there. But I managed to, from the Point Size Heroes, off the uh, display box, those two, they only cost me 2 99 each. I thought I might get them for free because they're chucking the box out, but unfortunately not. But, you know, fair play, 2 99 for little ditty figures. I was quite pleased with those. And that's, um, I think this one's a rare one, if I remember correctly. So that's pretty good. Um, the next one, uh, this was from Toys R Us as well. And uh, this is three forty-nine. I can't remember. Something like that, anyway. And uh, we got Brock Lesnar from the WWE. Yeah, again, not one I'm particularly worried about. Quite nicely detailed though, he's got all his tattoos and everything on there. But I've never been a, a massive Brock fan, I mean he's had some damn good matches. But he's an arrogant son of a bitch. Um, I don't really like the guy. Um, yeah. So, um, if anybody wants that one, yeah, I'm willing to trade him. Um, and uh, I'll just show you actually on the back. There's no characters there that I'm like, oh, I've definitely got to have that. I mean, there's some nice ones there. You know, you've got uh, Bret Hart. Gold Dust would be kind of fun. Um, Cena would get burnt. <laughs> I'd set fire to it. If you think I'm kidding, I'm not. I would set fire to it. <laughs> um, I think you've got Big Show on there. He'd be quite fun to have. And uh, uh, Oh, no, Randy Orton... Yeah, and a stinger might be quite nice. Yeah, not ones I'm, I'm not worried about. I think there's another series of these. I, I can't remember. Um, there's some different ones on, but it's it's Funko again. You know, they're known. All these things are running Funko these days. Seems to be anyway. Um, they get all the licenses and everything. Uh, but yeah, you know, nice, nice enough figure, but not really for me. Um, anyway, the rest of these are, uh, I've shown you some of these before, it's the Star Wars Mystery Minis, uh, and it's the original tri uh, trilogy, yeah, or triology, however you want to pronounce it. Yeah, and you see who we got on the back there. Uh, as I said, I do know who I've got, but they're quite nice ones, and I probably will collect all of these eventually. These were from uh, Hawkins Bazaar again, and this time, instead of being the uh, 6.99 or whatever it was. These were 3.49, so I grabbed four of them. You know, I thought, why the heck not? First off, we have Han Solo. Yeah, and I do quite like the mystery minis. They're, um, you know, they're different to the pops. Um, you know, people say, oh, get daubs and stuff as well because they're different, but I don't really like daubs and I don't see getting the point of getting the point size pops because they're exactly the same as the big ones, so just get the big one, yeah? But, you know, the, the, the point size heroes and these, for the most part, yeah, pretty good, pretty good. Uh, next up we have... If I can get it to come open... There we go. We've got a. I think it's counts as a Toy Fighter pilot. Or is it a Death Trooper? I don't know. I can I can never remember. I think it's a Death Trooper maybe. Yeah. It's one of those ones that wasn't in the films an awful lot, but they were there. It's sort of a case of blinking you miss them. Uh, so yeah, another another good one. Um, as I say, pretty good detailed. I like them anyway. A lot of people don't. Then we got, uh, oh yeah, Snaggletooth. So you can go with my pop. <laughs> Same colour as well, if I remember correctly. I didn't have the one with the blue. The, the blue. 
He's a bit more detailed than I remember him in the movies, but hey ho, you know, that's that's not a bad thing. So yeah, nice enough, got a little gun there as well. And let's get rid of these boxes out of the way. Too many boxes. Just empty the rubbish bin as well. I'll have to do it again now. Uh, <laughs> and finally, C3PO. Now, the only one with this, his bubble head is a bit weak. And I can't get it without... Ah, oh, I might have, might have solved it. Might have solved it, there you go. Because he was looking off at a weird angle. Not that it's really that important, but you know. But you do have to be careful with these. His, his bubble head doesn't really work. I think that's probably... Got knackered in the uh, the other one. The other, the other ones, you know, they you know, work a little bit better. This is a bit stiff. <laughs> I'm not even going to say it. No, I'm not. I'm <laughs> just <This is> impatient. <laughs> so, yeah, some nice little figures there. So you got Brock from WWE, the Harley. In black and white, the little uh, old school Batman, and so on. Oh, fuck in, show to you, you bastard. Fuck off. <laughs> C3PO, Snaggle's tooth, whatever he's called, and yeah, as I say, the, 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 uh, I think it's a, the characters of Death Troop as opposed to a uh, um, TIE Fighter pilot. Because he looks more like a traditional Stormtrooper. So yeah, there you go. Nice little selection of figures. Um, as per usual, let me know what you think. Yeah, big shout out to my subscribers. If you're not subscribed already, please click that button wherever it is. There's a that down there in it. Yeah, down there somewhere. Um, <laughs> Search the direction, man. Um, yeah, so uh, really that's that's it. Um, I think I've mentioned about the uh, food ideas for the uh, forthcoming uh, taste video thingy. Basically, give me two ingredients that don't normally go together. We'll put it in a sandwich and we'll try it. And if you want to be a volunteer for it, excellent. Um, I think I'm all videoed out. Well done, four of these today. We've been about the space of an hour or so. So um, this is just so I've basically got a few to put up over the week because uh, I've got my mum and dad's wedding anniversary coming up. Fifty years, amazing, amazing. So yeah, uh, and I've got some birthdays coming up as well. So uh, I've got to look out for that. Anyway, folks. Enough waffling, uh, I'm going to get these uploaded and edited and all the other malarkey. Um, I think that's all I've got to say. So, as always, take care of yourselves. Thanks again for watching and I shall see you in another video. Take care now, bye bye.